Hi guys, it's me, Teacher Gon. In our today's video, we will divide mixed numbers. So without further ado, let's do this topic. In this video, I will give you a step-by-step -step guide on how are we going to divide mixed numbers. A lot of students are finding this, this topic difficult because they don't know the step-by-step -step process on how to do it. Now let's get started. We have here 2 and 1 third divided by 3 and 2 over 5. Now, what is the first step in dividing these mixed numbers? First, you need to convert each mixed numbers into improper fraction. So how to do that? Multiply the, new, the denominator and the whole number. 3 times 2, that is equal to 6. Then add 6 and 1, that is equal to 7. Copy your original denominator, which is equal to 3. Copy your division symbol. Then convert the other mixed number. 5 times 3, that is equal to 15. Plus 2, that is equal to 17. And then over 5. So after converting this mixed numbers into improper fraction, what we need to do here is the next step. Copy your first fraction. This operation, division, will change into multiplication. Then after changing the operation, get the reciprocal of your second fraction. If this is 17 over 5, the reciprocal is 5 over 17. What's happening here, if you're getting the reciprocal, you're interchanging the position of your denominator to numerator, your numerator into denominator. Then after that, you can directly multiply. 7 times 5, that is equal to 30, how many? 35. 3 times 17 is equal to 51. And now, the quotient of these two mixed numbers is equal to 35 over 51. That is how you divide mixed numbers. Now let's move on with item number 2. With item number 2, what we have here is 5 and 3 over 5 divided by 2 and 1 third. Same process, convert this first into mixed number. Improper fraction rather, 5 times 5 is 25, add, that is equal to 28 over 5, copy, convert this one into improper fraction, 3 times 2, that is equal to 6, plus 1, that is equal to 7, over 3. Now what's next here is this. Copy your first fraction, 28 over 5. Change this one into multiplication. Get the reciprocal of your second fraction. That is 3 over 7. Now after copying, changing the operation, getting the reciprocal, you can directly multiply the numerators and denominators, but to avoid a bigger number, we can cancel out 28 and 7. Their greatest common factor is 7, so we can cancel this out and make it equal to 4. And we can also cancel this out, 7, and make it equal to 1. In this case, mababa na lang yung magiging numbers natin. So let's multiply. 4 times 3, that is equal to 12. 5 times 1, that is equal to 5. Now, compared to our first problem, as you can see, the answer is 35 over 51. This one is a proper fraction. In our number 2 problem, the quotient is an improper fraction. Some of the teachers will accept this answer, but other teachers will require that 
you need to convert this one into a mixed number first. So how to do that? Let us divide 12 by 5. 12 divided by 5 is 2. 2 times 5 is 10. Subtract this. This is equal to 2. Now, what is the answer? The answer here, get the quotient, which is 2. Your remainder will serve as the new numerator. And copy the original denominator, which is 5. Meaning, the answer here is simply 12 over 5 or 2 and 2 over 5. That's it, guys. Now, as part of our routine, I will give you a problem wherein you will divide these mixed numbers. This will be item number 3. And I hope na ilagay nyo sa ating comment section what is your answer. 8 and 2 over 5 divided by 4 and 2 over 7. So I hope guys learn something from this video on how to divide mixed numbers. Guys, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe but hit the bell button for you to be updated sa ating latest uploads. Again, it's me, Teacher Gon. Maraming maraming salamat. Bye-bye!